at how you upload or how to create your website. Now what you need to understand first off is that this you need to do this with the sound on. It doesn't work without the sound on. Um, so you actually can hear what I am doing at the same time. So, and also you need to watch the whole thing first. I suggest that you watch the whole thing first. Um, see how you do it and then once you've done that then um, you can create the website once um, you are watching or listening to the video for the second time okay so here we go so what you need to do is go to your google drive uh, make sure you go to 9mu because that is your 9 music folder once you've done that go to new and then slide over and go to google sites that will create a google site and yes you want to create and share so what it will do is create this brand new looking template um, of a website and this is how we then create some stuff so first off here what I want you to do is I would like you to put in as your title is music and then your last name and then the initial of your first name so last name F is what I'm going to do so again it is your last name which is there, and then your initial of your F, uh, initial of your first letter. So if my name was John Smith, it would be Smith J. All right. So once you've done that, what I want you to do is now create um, a title for your website. Now it might be quite interesting if you create a pun, or if you have a look, Google search music or uh, puns um, involving music or music puns. And I would say mine could be uh, Bark. House. It says Batch House, um, but it's actually Bark as in the composer. So that could be mine. Um, then what I want to do, I don't like this green image, I'm going to change it. So I'm going to change image, I am going to uh, upload an image, no I'm not going to upload. I'm going to change image and I'm going to select an image. I can search through uh, Google if I wanted to. So I'm going to search in, um, let's type in violin because I quite like the violin, because I learned the violin. Um, and I'm going to pick that one there, because it looks like a bit of a banner. Select it. Um, and then it will appear right there on my website. Um, now I have got a front page. Um, now with that front page, I need to put some titles in there. So the easiest way to do that is, is that I can either go the insert page and type in text box, and I'm going to put in some titles. So my titles are going to be music in my life. That's one title. Also, I want to make it slightly bigger. So I'm going to change the heading to subheading. I'm going to drag that over um, and then I'm going to add in another text box and it is called ukulele or ukulele in today. so there's both in there um, and then I'm going to also change the heading there um, the size of it uh, I'm going to add in another text box and it is going to say uh, New Zealand Music and that also is, um, let's just leave it at New Zealand Music, change that font size um, and then I'm also going to insert another text box and it is going to be stomp, exclamation mark. So these are the four topics that we'll have you looking at in music um, in the near future, but we're just preparing things uh, ahead of time. Now you can leave it like that if you want, uh, you can slightly change it. So I'm going to actually take this and I'm going to move it up here. I'm going to take this one and I'm going to move it up here to make that a bit smaller. Move that over and then I'm going to take this one and I'm going to move that there. So it just actually uh, fits a bit better. I'm going to center that, hopefully. There we go. So now it makes it a bit more uh, presentable. Okay. Um, so these are the uh, the headings of the new pages that um, we will make. Um, and then this looks a bit boring, so I'm just going to add another image. Now how I did that, so if I double tap um, on the mouse, 
um, I can then add in something. So I'm going to search, um, I'm going to type in Drake. I quite like Drake. Um, and I like, there's not many photos of Drake here, so I like that one. So I'm just going to put that there. I'm going to make him center, put him in the center. Um, and there's Drake uh, being the man that he is. Um, in my in my website okay so then um, we're gonna leave it uh, oh then what you need to do we're not gonna leave it um, once you've put in your picture you put in these uh, headings um, and then you have done all this you can actually change themes as well so I can go to themes don't quite like that theme and maybe I might change it to that theme um, might go to level might go to vision no, don't like vision. Let's go to diplomat. So that could be right there. Um, um, and then that is there and done and dusted. Um, if I then press publish. Um, and then it will give me um, the address of the web address, which is uh, music um, hyphen last name F. Um, and then I press publish. And then what happened? will create two versions of this website. So the version that will be create is this one, and this is the working uh, website, okay? So this is when I talk about the template website, and then also there's the publish website. Now to get to publish website, I go to view, publish site, um, and then I can then click on here, and this is now the website that um, I have created at this present stage. What I want you to do with the published website, I want you to copy the URL, so copy, and then I want to put it into the assignment area of um, of Classcraft. Okay, so that is the video there. Um, good luck. Have a bit of play around with the website, um, and we'll show you in the next video what you need to do after that. All right, get that.